Sonny Donnelly, IFL TV in association with Macklin's Jim Mark Bayer. I'm at York Hall today for the Frank Warren Show with me. Now 4-0, still undefeated with a great stoppage over Joe Beden, Archie Sharp. Arch, mate, amazing performance. You had the crowd buzzing, you looked amazing. Uh, how'd you feel? Yeah, I thought, bro, no thanks. Like I say, the crowd was good out there. And uh, I love your cheers, now. The crowd was good out there today. Picked me right up, I was, I was on the high. And I just see it, I see the, I see the stoppage coming. I'm opening him up, making him miss. As I'm making him miss, I'm countering. Obviously, Joe Beden is known well around the circuit for being tough, durable. And obviously, in his 34 losses, he's been stopped three times now, is it? Yeah, three You're the third time. Yeah. I mean, that speaks for itself. What was he like in there? Tough? Yeah, it was a good, listen, it was a good, it was a good opponent to come out, do you know what I mean? It was a good experience for me being in there. And like you say, he hasn't been stopped. So it was a good stoppage for me today. Do you know what I mean? After my last performance here at your call, which was a good performance, we went back and worked on things. We're only going to keep learning, we're only going to keep getting better. Every time at the gym, we're working on new things, and it's going to be a show today. Obviously, Richard, this could be a massive year for him, potentially. Are you going to start looking at titles soon, or have no, a few I mean, more fights? I'm not going to run just yet. I mean, he's, uh, he's four at home. He's a four-round boxer at the moment. I'll be speaking to the office and uh, pushing very hard to get him on the, uh, the big show, the top of box, and uh, moving him up to six rounds, which I think, well, we all think that's probably what he needs. But he's improving all the time under Richard, uh, Richard Sawyer, and Jason Nolan and Archie are looking after him. And he's very, very respectful. He's very open to new ideas. Um, he's willing to learn. As you can see, the, the shape of him. He's a very hard worker. He works very hard in the gym. He's a consummate pro, actually. He's a pleasure to work for. And um, he, as you can see, he's very talented. He's got a nice punch selection. Like all amateurs that turn over, you know, there's, there's rough edges to knock off and bits and pieces to do the transition. But that will come in time, and we'll be looking, not for titles next, we'll be looking for six rounders, obviously, and then, you know, take it from there. Obviously, like he says, 4 and 0, you've still got a lot to learn. How have you felt yourself change since your pro debut not so long ago? Do you know what? I'm always learning and always will be learning. I've done it as an amateur, do you know what I mean? I won a lot as an amateur and I was always learning that. At the minute, for my first pro fight, it was a little bit over eager, if you like. Do you know what I mean? I was very eager. Sure. But now I'm just settling down, picking the shots. Like I say, second round, I opened him up. I went, I pushed forward a little bit, I knew it weren't coming, so therefore I stepped back and just work on the shots again, you know what I mean? Select the shots and then wait for that big shot and that would throw your shots and stopped it. So. No, obviously, like Richard said, you're in amazing shape. How did the camp go for this fight? It went very, uh, very well, thank you. Do you know what I mean? I'm always training. Good sparring over at um, West Ham with, uh, with the Tibbs. And um, see, so yeah, I've had good preparation to, just, to the um, up leading to the fight. All right then, mate. Well, you've done yourself proud. Your fans were buzzing. You're 4-0, you live to fight another day, but um, Archie, congratulations. Uh, thanks very much for talking Cheers, to me. Cheers mate, thank, thank you very much. You.